Let's solve lead code problem 1460. Make two arrays equal by reversing subarrays. The question goes like this. You are given two integer array of equal length, target and array. In one step, you can select any non-empty substring of ARR and reverse it. You are allowed to make any number of steps. Return true if you can make ARR equal to target or false otherwise. So what they're saying is you're given target and ARR, two arrays, and <clears throat> you can take any subarray of ARR and say two and four or four or one or one or three and two four one or four one three or entire thing, right? You can take any of the subarray and reverse it, okay? And you can follow this step any number of times, just that you need to convert it into the target array, okay? And all they are asking, they are not actually asking you to solve it, they are asking whether you can do it or not. Whether you can do it or not, it is definitely possible in this, in some way or the other, right? It is definitely possible in the second example, they are just one number, seven and seven. So it's already uh, same as the target. ARR is same as target. And the third one, ARR and target have different some elements. So there is a nine in target, but instead of nine, there is an 11 in ARR. So in no way, how much ever you try to do this, it will never get converted to the target, right? So essentially what you understand from this question is that given the same numbers in ARR and target, there is definitely in some way or the other, you can convert ARR to target, right? It might, some might take uh, very few, attempts for example if it is already uh, matching some might take a lot of attempts but there's if if the now if the elements are matching then definitely there is a way if the elements are not matching then there is no way so that's all that we need to figure out right so all i'll do is to compare the two array that they have the same elements, I'll sort them. Say ARR target dot sort and target dot sort. I'll sort both of them. Once sorted, I'll just return if the sorted array is equal to target array, right? Let's run and see. That's how this simple this question is. It worked for the test case. It worked because they're just asking if it is possible or not. They're not asking you to actually do it. I'm submitting it. It took 62 milliseconds, 20, better than 26% of the users. Let's look at the best solution. Exactly what we did, right? Let's look at some other solutions. They're all returning and doing exactly what we did. So that's how you solve this problem. 1460 make two arrays equal by reversing subarrays. Just a quick suggestion. I post a lot of lead code on YouTube. YouTube, you could come across this video again and again. To avoid that, just post something in the comments and when you check out my video, just check your comments if it is there, which means that you've already watched the video. If not, then you can continue watching the video. See you in the next video.